Depression's be killing and it's gonna keep killing. Nigerians be migrating and they're gonna keep migrating. Headsmen be killing and they're gonna keep killing if we let them. Sars been extorting and killing unjustly and they're gonna keep at it if we let them. The police is your friend, yeah? <laughs> but even with the videos and pictures, Femi, oh sorry, what's he called? The CEO of the block industry of Twitter still think all we do is make stories up and he stays calm like our lives ain't worth a dime. When on the dime he gets are paid for by a job, he got to protect his life that ain't what? A dime. But shout out Sega Link. Shout out Citizen Gavo, Roger D. Baba, just to name a few. Training the hashtags and making sure the oppressed are set free without further extortions. This is Nigeria. We are terrorists are rewarded in the name of amnesty. Why you get shot in the rats to turn up dead for being law abiding? When we sans be giving amnesty by the way so the killings and harassment can stop. Politicians steal on the daily and untouchable, but if I'm young and walk down the street trying to make a living off this mediocre economy, I become touchable and my poor. Dear Nigeria, do I have to be a criminal to be safe in Nigeria? What crime do me and my friends have to commit so we can get paid for life, aka amnesty? I grew up watching crime fighters on TV, but the transmission got altered with too many transmissions. We stopped the transmission from transmitting crime fighters. Now I get to watch crime fighters on the gram and Twitter with the hashtag and sass. We are now the crime fighters fighting crime against the people who are supposed to be the crime fighters. This isn't even fiction. It's the reality we live in. When I was in church, I was taught evil prevail when good men do nothing. I also learned God hates oppression. So what's up with the church and mosque? How are you silent with so much killings in the land? Yeah, you pray for the country and oppress, but prayer would work has to be valid in this situation, don't you think? I may not have all the answers in the world, but I know one thing. We were made to love, not fear. We must rise above fear and terror. While we train the hashtag and SARS, pray for Benu, we stop the suit. We must also demand our rights and take our country back. March to the street peacefully with love and demand justice. All they have is their guns and greed. What we have is unity ourselves and love and love conquers heart. Like the Golden State Warriors. There is strength in numbers and we must use that to our advantage. Stop the killings. Stop the suit. And SARS. Reform police. Peace.